Hello everyone, this is our second chapter searching and sorting and our today's topic is selection sort. In this topic, we learn example of selection sort, algorithm of selection sort and program for selection sort. Selection sort. In selection sort, we first select minimum element means smallest element in this array and exchange with first index element. Then divide this array into two sub arrays. First part is sorted array and second part is unsorted array. In every iteration of selection sort, the minimum element from the unsorted sub array is picked and moved to the sorted sub array. In selection sort, the worst case and average case time complexity is big O n square. If we have total n elements, then we need to repeat this process for n minus 1 times. Example of selection sort. In this example, size of array is 7. Means here, 7 element is present. First, we find out smallest element from this array. So here, 12 is smallest element. So we swap, means exchange 12 with first position element. So here, in first position, 42 is present. So we swap 12 and 42. So in after pass 1, we swap 12 and 42 element. Now, we divided this array in two sub array part. So first part is called sorted that is 12 is sorted and remaining element is unsorted. Now we find out smallest element from this unsorted sub array. Here 16 is smallest element. But 16 is also present in first position of this unsorted array. So we cannot exchange 16 with some other elements. So in after pass 2, 16 is now sorted sub array and remaining element is unsorted sub array. Now we repeat this process and find out smallest element from this unsorted sub array. Here 26 is smallest element from this unsorted sub array. So we exchange 26 and first position element. So here in first position unsorted sub array is 84. So we exchange 84 and 26. Now in after pass 3 we exchange this 26 and 84 and now sorted sub array is 12. 16 and 26 and remaining array is unsorted. Now we repeat this process and find out smallest element from this sub array. Now 42 is smallest element from this unsorted sub array. But 42 is already present in the first position so we cannot exchange 42. So in after pass 4, 42 is in sorted sub array and remaining element is in unsorted sub array. So we repeat this process and find out smallest element. Here 53 is smallest element. So we exchange means swap 53 and 77. So in after pass 5, we exchange these two numbers. And now sorted array is 12, 16, 26, 42 and 53. Now unsorted sub array is 84 and 77. Now repeat this process and find out smallest element. Now this 77 is small, smallest element. So we exchange 77 and 84. So in after pass 6, we exchange this two numbers and we got sorted array. That is 12, 16, 
ट्वेंटी सिक्स फोर्टी टू फिफ्टी थ्री सेवेंटी सेवन एंड एट्टी फोर सो वी गॉट अवर सॉर्टेड एरे यूजिंग यूजिंग सिलेक्शन अलगोरिदम फॉर सिलेक्शन सॉर्ट ऑल ऑफ यू नो अबाउट हाउ एग्जाम्पल वर्क इन सिलेक्शन सॉर्ट इन सिलेक्शन सॉर्ट वी फर्स्ट सिलेक्ट स्मॉलेस्ट एलिमेंट एंड एक्सचेंज द स्मॉलेस्ट एलिमेंट विथ अवर फर्स्ट लोकेशन एलिमेंट सो सी हियर इन दिस अलगोरिदम फर्स्ट स्टेप इज रिपीट स्टेप टू टू सिक्स फॉर आई इज इक्वल टू जीरो आई लेस देन एन माइनस वन एंड आई प्लस प्लस हियर वैल्यू ऑफ आई इज जीरो मीन्स आई पॉइंट टू दी जीरो लोकेशन नाउ आई लेस देन एन माइनस वन आई इज यूज फॉर पासिस सो आई स्टार्ट फ्रॉम जीरो एंड पास टू फोर मीन्स हियर वैल्यू ऑफ एन इज सिक्स सिक्स माइनस वन इज फाइव सो आई लेस देन फाइव मीन्स पासिस स्टार्ट फ्रॉम जीरो टू फोर सो सी हियर इन दिस एग्जाम्पल अवर पास स्टार्ट फ्रॉम जीरो टू फोर Now in step two, minimum is equal to i. So here value of i is zero. That's why mean is equal to also zero. So here mean is also point to the zeroth location. Now in step three, repeat steps four and five for j is equal to i plus one and j less than n and j plus this means here value of j is one. Because value of i is zero, so zero plus one is one, so j is equal to one, and j less than n. Value of n is six, means j go start from one to five, because j less than n means j less than six, means j start from one to five. Okay. Now, in step four, if a of mean is greater than a of j. Now, see here in this example, our a of mean is twenty three and a of j is seventy eight. Because a of mean is zero, a of zero is twenty three, and a of j means a of one is seventy eight. So here. Twenty three is greater than seventy eight. This condition is false. That's why we cannot enter in step five. So repeat this process means four and five. Step repeat this step four and five means here now j is incremented by one. Means j incremented by one means j is two. Now j is shifted to the So our mean is zero and j is two. Now we compare a of mean means a of zero greater than a of two. So here a of zero is twenty three and a of two is forty five. So this condition is also false. So we cannot update our mean. So now j is also incremented by one. So now J is point to the third location and minimum is in zero position. So now we repeat this process and check a of mean means a of zero greater than a of three. So a of three is eight and a of mean is twenty three. So twenty three is greater than eight. This condition is true. Now we enter in step five. So here mean is equal to j means value of j is three. So now mean is point to the third location. So now mean is in three and j is incremented by one. So j is point to the fourth location. Now we repeat this process and check a of mean is greater than a of j. So eight is greater than thirty two. This condition is also false. Now j is also incremented by one, and we also check this condition means step four. That is, a of means is greater than a of j. Now a of mean is eight is greater than a of j is fifty six. This condition is also false. So in 
नेक्स्ट जे इज इंक्रीमेंटेड बाय वन दिस कंडीशन इज फॉल्स बिकॉज जे इज लेस देन एन सो हियर वी गॉट अवर मिनिमम वैल्यू दैट इज एट सो नाउ चेक इन स्टेप इन स्टेप सिक्स इफ मेन इज नॉट इक्वल टू आई हियर अवर मेन इज थ्री एंड आई इज जीरो सो दिस कंडीशन इज ट्रू एंड वी स्वैप a of i and a of mean so here a of i is 0 that is 23 and a of mean is 8 so we exchange 23 and 8 in pass 0 why we check this condition mean is not equal to i because our i is a, is in zeroth position so we exchange minimum element with our first position element so if this element is sa same then we cannot exchange the element that's why we first check this two element is different then we exchange minimum element with first position element okay so now we complete this process and repeat process that is 2 to 6 so i is incremented by 1 means we enter in pass 1 so in pass 1 now value of i is 1 so value of mean is also 1 now mean is started from 1 means mean is started from 78 and here j is equal to 1 plus 1 it is 2 means j is point to the 2 so we find minimum element means smallest element from this unsorted array okay so now we repeat this process till pass 4 and we got our sorted array so all of i hope all of you understand program for selection sort first we initialize array a of 100 100 is size of array n is used for size i is used for passes j is used for compare two numbers mean is used for store minimum number and comparing well elements temp is temporary variable used for swapping two numbers now we create array printf enter number of elements scanf percentage t address of n suppose we enter size of n is 5 now we enter numbers in this array so we use printf enter percent d numbers n then for loop i is equal to 0 i less than n i plus plus then scan f percent d address of a of i means here first value of i is 0 means first we enter number or element in zeroth position and i incremented by 1 means we enter all element in this array now all of you know working of algorithm so start here our selection sort algorithm first for loop that is i is equal to 0 i use for passes and i less than n minus 1 so here if value of n is 4 means passes start from 0 to 3 now mean is equal to i means value of i is 0 so i and mean is point to the zeroth position now j is equal to i plus 1 so here value of i is 0 so 0 plus 1 is 1 now j is point to the first location now we compare value of mean is greater than value of j here if mean means first position value is greater than second position value then our mean index is second position 
okay next we check if mean is not equal to i means our minimum value is in not in first position because mean value and our first position is also same then we cannot exchange the minimum value so always minimum value and our first index value is different so if this condition is true then we swap this two number and we repeat this process until we get our sorted array means we repeat this process to pass 3 and for print this number we use print a sorted array and for loop for print this whole array then print a percent d a of i means i started from 0 to less than n so we print this sorted array using this for loop and a of so i hope all of you clear this program program is same as algorithm so first we all of you understand algorithm then you easily understand this program output of the selection sort program here first we enter number of element so we enter 4 next enter four numbers so we enter unsorted four numbers 4 2 7 and 1 so we get our output is sorted array is 1 2 4 and 7 i hope all of you understand working of selection sort all of you practice selection sort example and algorithm and perform and execute program for selection sort thank you